Hello? It's hard. Okay, so I was coming back from the store trying to gather things to be able to call this new place home, and I ain't got no complaints. I love the area. I'm way more closer to the other side of my family, so I get to see them a lot more often. The corn lady and the slushy guy be circling around the block every 30 minutes. It's great. It's been super fun trying to get all comfortable until that night. I came around the corner and my whole body just froze. There was an unexpected visitor waiting for me at my doorstep. was the biggest, brownest, steroid driven, doesn't look like he ate both his parents of a cockroach. Those of you guys who know my history of living with cockroaches in the past know this happening right when I move in is completely unacceptable. And if you haven't noticed, DeMonte is playing the role of said cockroach due to the low volume of cockroach film trainers in my area, bug spray. The bug spray, of course, is inside of the house. And it was like the big little motherfucker knew the perfect spot to be in, chilling right on the door talking about this bitch gotta get inside the house sometime. So then I start picking up objects around me to see if I can just make it at least scurry away from the door. I said, and he said, no. All right, so that's not working. Since he's not moving, let's just go ahead and suck it up and power our way through the door and hope to baby Sinclair that he doesn't hop on my body. I would hate to have to burn my clothes. I ran up the steps and tried to close it super fast so I could at least make him stay outside just as the door was about to close. He said, jumped from the door to the wall, looked up at me like, bitch, what's for dinner? I felt so threatened. At this point, I'm annoyed. So I run straight from my bug spray, came back all prepared. I said, and then he, he just stood there as if I just sprayed him with the water hose. I understand that it's just one bug, but we cannot take early chances like this. I went ahead and called an exterminator. Now what tripped me out about the exterminator is that they walked in here so confident. charge your debit card for the trip here. Have a good day, bitch. So I'm basically living with a five foot and a half tall cockroach right now. There's been absolutely no solution. I'm just living in fear for the rest of my life. I've been having dreams about them crawling in my ears and having babies. But with everything that's been going on, this actually has taught me a valuable lesson. A very basic one too. Fear is gonna be in front of you at all times. And running away from it doesn't necessarily make it go away. But right now, if you are not hitting that like button right now for that amazing exterminator song, I'm gonna go back and get those pots and pans and do some crazy with it. The winner of my Amazon gift card from the last video is right here. If you want a chance to try and get one, answer this question. What should I name my new pet cockroach? But as you guys all know, my name is hard. Fuck you, I'm here to give you as much life as possible. And I'm gonna see you guys later.